All right, everyone. It has been a few days, and the trailer is coming along. I spent about two days moving stuff in, and still need to get a wash and dryer. I have to unpack all this stuff. <sighs> Who likes unpacking? Because I do not. Oh, there we go. Light on. This is the room over here. I don't remember if you saw it real good in the other video, but it has the door to the back with the ramp. I use that for moving in a lot of furniture, but I didn't really use it for much else. Kitchen. And it's hot right now. It's probably the hottest time of the year. And this air conditioner, it is doing really well. It's the only air conditioner in the property, and it is doing really well, except for the fact that it, it, it kind of stops when you get to the hallway. When you get into the laundry room, it kind of stops, um, but, the, but the air's got to go all the way around these corners. I have a fan set up right now. It's just a little fan to go into that room to blow the cold air down. Uh, I'm going to get a bigger fan. And see if that works. If not, I want to get a more better air conditioner. So behind that door is where the bedroom, where there's no carpet, and there's a hole in the floor, and then a little half bath. I already winterized the half bath. We might work on that some more. Um, I need to fix this door. It's not shutting well, and it's letting air in there. And this room is full of all more stuff. I know it looks horrible. We just walked in and threw it in. Uh, I'm getting it all put up. Uh, that wall over there, I've sanded. I got a little project started. Um, oh yeah, I gotta fix that. Uh, like five pieces of duct tape does not fix it, apparently. Uh, well, I think it's six, but still. Um, it, it was leaking at one point. It's not leaking now, but still, I'll have to get on the roof and fix that. All right, going outside. It's very loud on the porch uh, due to the air conditioner. But we got our flag out. Uh, just scanned the property. None of that in front of the barn was cut the last time. Couple steps here. This whole field was still cut up last time. My stepfather. Uh, has a mower that I guess it's like a tractor too I don't know but he spent hours mowing all of this for me and I, I didn't even know he was going to do it it was fantastic but all this is mowed I don't know if you can see now but now you can see my property line goes all the way down to the corner where uh, you kind of see the fence go down and then over and all this there's the barn a lot of work to do over there all right, let's keep going around. I haven't got rid of any of this yet. The snake habitat in the old video that I talked about, here it is. It's a two-tier pond thing, I guess. But I don't know. It's a lot of field dirt, that's what I know. But oh well. Nothing much has happened out here is the cactus still. Weed uh we weed eat all of that. Trim the apple tree. It is broke off is the reason it's not doing great. And a blight. And I just bumped into that cactus and ripped my arm open. I am fixing to buy 10 gallons of gas and torch that sucker. So here's the apple tree. It had had a blight and 
in this branch here cut off. I'm going to cut that better and paint it to try to give it a chance. Um, oh look, there's a cicada on it. You see that? There he goes. Uh, he ain't hurt nothing. And this, which I thought were grapes the whole time, are muscadines. I wish they were grapes. The muscadines are still good. So then, just taking back, all of this was grown out, out to here. And just trying to somewhat take back some of the property. I'm going to do that all the way down here and all the way down here. Hopefully today. Like I said, it is hot. Alright, there's the front yard. It's all still mowed. I'll come down here. And here is another day's worth of work. And that's so dark. I don't know if you guys can see that. I gotta get electricity run out here. I gotta get all of this stuff. Look at that wall. I should call that the wall of pain. Look at all those tools to work with. Must be a crazy person. But, alright, that's it for now. I gotta run to Home Depot, which seems to be an everyday occurrence. So, uh, I'll check back after I get some more work done.